guys, Jojo here. It is roughly 11.22 at night. I am at GameStop, and we are here to pick up our midnight release of the Switch, because we're not cool enough to get it ahead of time like all those like legit YouTubers. <laughs> anyway, we are going into the GameStop and we are going to get our version of the Switch. Um, we're not getting Twilight, or pff, Twilight Princess. We are not getting um, Breath of the Wild until tomorrow, but I will make sure to show you guys once I get that. Anyway, let's head on in. All right, guys, I am waiting in line. I am in group two, which is the best group, and we are waiting um, for our games and the system to be released to Switch. So they say we're picking it up at the door right behind me. The game is being picked up at the counter right behind me, and then the amiibos are being picked up in the corner. However, I forgot to order an amiibo, so hopefully they'll have some more tomorrow. Or maybe I can pick one up now. We'll see. I'm crossing my fingers. Anyway, we're just waiting in line for now, and soon they will call us. Soon. It is time, my friends. It is time. Here we go, guys. It's console time. Yay, thank you so much. Woo! Guys, look at it. It's so pretty. It's so pretty and I'm super zoomed, but I'm excited. Look how amazing it is. Ah, this is it. We got the switch. Guys, I'm so excited. I'm going to go home and do an unboxing of this so you guys can see what the innards of this box looks like. So let's go home and unwrap it, shall we? So excited, you guys. I'm so excited. Thank you, GameStop. I appreciate it so much. Bye. All right, dudes and dudettes. Ignore the tired face. It's midnight, but this is what we've all been waiting for. The opening of the Nintendo Switch. All right, so I'm going to do an unboxing video. Um, hopefully it goes over well and I can unbox everything so that we won't <laughs> have to do too many edits on it. Sorry, I'm already doing it wrong. All right, so first and foremost, you open up the flap. Open up flap number two. All right, so we've got a little of how to set it up instructions. Need help? Ask an adult. I don't have an adult. There it is, you guys. The Nintendo Switch. Look at that, you can see a manufacturer's fingerprint on there. <laughs> All right, so this Looks like it's the Switch. It's relatively small. Like, my hands are not giant. And that's about the size of it. Joy-Cons. From what people have said, the Joy-Cons actually are very easy to hold. And they did recently do a patch for the, um, the problem with the left Joy-Con. Yeah, that's a good size, actually. I feel like you could get used to it. Rufio. Rufio's come to help. He's come to help us. Yeah, but, um, that feels pretty nice in my hand. I think that could work. Okay, so there are both the Joy-Cons. Oh, that clicks as well. So, not just that, just click. So there's a the little clicker. All right, Rue, that is enough. <laughs> now you're making a mess. <laughs> all right, so then the actual screen. I'm doing this all with my left hand, good. So the actual screen is actually like a tablet size. It's quite nice, actually. Switch. Switch! How exciting. Um, yeah, so I guess that's kind of where it goes into the dock. I'll just kind of take out all the pieces for now. Underneath, of course, you've got your paperwork. So you've got all your little bits and baubles. What's this guy? Oh, goodness. Oh, oh, it's the porting station. It's the porting station. I can tell already. All right, you guys, I'm gonna put you down for a second. I need two hands for this one. All right, I used the switch box to prop it up, so actually, the switch box came into good use. All right, so here is the porting spin challenge. Oh, look at that. That looks really nice. Yeah, so I guess it just slides right in there from what we've seen from all commercials. Cat, I'm gonna get you, Rufio, seriously. Yeah, so this is the porting station, it looks like. A little doohickey should slide right in there. I'm gonna keep the plastic on it for now, just to keep everything 
finger free for the time being. So we've got those two things. Okay. And this I guess is the actual, so the actual handheld playing device. That's good. That's good. From what I've heard, you can just slide the two Joy-Cons just right on top of the console there, and it should be very comfortable to hold. Sorry, I keep cutting off my head. That's okay. It's late. My mind's not all here. And then, of course, you have all the whole, the cords. So you've got your HDMI cable. You've got your thing that also attaches to the wall part of it. <laughs> so scientific. I know all the electronic words to everything. Uh -huh. And you have the Joy-Con holders. Look at those things. Look at They probably cost like $30 each on their own. Excellent. Anyway, you guys, that pretty much was everything. Hang on, I'm going to turn you around. All right, so that's everything. You've got the actual Switch um, cartridge holder. You've got the Switch screen for when you are on the go. You have both Joy-Cons, both the right and the left Joy-Con, which go comfortably inside of the control handle. And then you have the cords and the handles. Um, I don't know how other people... And then empty box, if you're interested. Nothing else in there. Nothing. Nothing. Want to read the control manual? That's all right there. Anyway, you guys, it is extremely late here. Um, I'm really glad that I could open that with you. And if you weren't able to get one today, hopefully that wasn't a spoiler. I don't think opening a box is really a spoiler, though, is it? Anyway, um, I'm glad you guys opened it with me. Um, Rufio's very happy that we have a new box in the family. <laughs> He's very excited about that. Anyway, you guys, thanks for watching. Here's the switch. Click it um, to subscribe and maybe... We'll do an unboxing of Breath of the Wild when I get it tomorrow. Anyway, you guys have a fantastic night, and I will see you soon. Bye!